All right, during this video, we'll talk about the hands and how close they should be to the back shoulder during the first move. And we also get into the top players in baseball and what they do during their first move. All right, so one of the keys to hitting in a big zone is to make sure that when you start your swing, very first move, when you get the toe touch, we already talked about having the hand close in here. Uh, but your very first move, you keep that hand close to the back shoulder, you know, what happens later, if it's an outside pitch, sure, you're going to start to extend the hands away some. But at, at the very beginning, when you do your first move, you're going to make sure your hands stay tight to the shoulder during the first move. We analyzed the top 10 Major League Baseball players in terms of batting average in 2023 to see what they did with their hands during their first move. Freddie Freeman here in the stance. You're going to see when he makes his first move. Here he is when he comes down the toe touch. His hands are close like we talked about before. But during his first move, he also keeps his hands close to his back shoulder. So the first move, his hands, you'll notice, are not moving away from his body. Uh, now later on in his swing, as he gets closer to connect, yes, he will start to extend his arms, hands away in order to get that extension and drive through the ball. But during the first move, he's, his hands remain close to his back shoulder. Yanny Diaz, again, you're going to see the same thing here. During his first move, you'll see that his hands started close to the shoulder and they stayed close to the shoulder. Now, as, now later on in the swing, he starts to extend, extend away. That's perfectly normal. But what we're talking about here is during his first move, and uh, at, during his first move, as you can see here, his hands are close to his back shoulder. Corey Seager, again, during his first move, you can see his elbow's gone down. His hands are close to his back shoulder. Mookie Betts, another player here, hands are real tight, close to the back shoulder. Then he extends away. Again, Bichette, hands are close to his back shoulder during his first move. Then he extends, starts to extend away as he gets closer to connect and drives the ball. All 10 players keep their hands close to their back shoulder during the first move. This enables them to have an inside-outside swing and hit consistently for high batting average. So whether a player's been playing for a while and he has a tendency to cast his hands away from his back shoulder or he's a new developing player, we we'd strongly recommend that you make this skill a high priority. You'll see significant gains in their swing and their batting average. Thank <music> you.